Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Assalamu alaikum. This is unit number 11. In my previous lectures, I have covered till unit number 10. And today I am going to start unit number 11. That is sentences, subject, verb and object. Subject, verb and object. Every sentence must have a subject and a verb. Every sentence must have a subject and a verb. Some sentences also have an object. For example, the sun. The sun is subject. The sun is subject. Is shining is verb. Shining is basically main verb and is helping verb. Okay. Is is the helping verb and shining is main verb. Subject is the sun is drying. It's a verb. The washing is object. Washing is object. The object is the person or thing. The object is the person or thing that is affected by the verb. That is affected by the verb as you can see in this example. The object usually comes after the verb in the sentence. It comes after the verb. Look, the sun is drying the washing. So, in this sentence, sun is subject, drying is verb and washing is object. So, the object usually comes after the verb in the sentence. Not all verbs can have an object. So, what you have learnt in today's lecture... Every sentence must have a subject and a verb. Some sentences also have an object. The sun is shining. The sun is shining. In this sentence, sun is subject and shining is verb. I hope you will like this lecture. Thank you so much for watching.